Election day is here and already the line is starting at one of the more than 180 polling locations in Marion County. It's nice to have a few more options, options here. Let's go right out to CBS 4's Alexa Green. She's live at the Benjamin Harrison presidential site with what you need to know ahead of election day. Alexa, a big question many people have. Are we seeing long lines again today? Hey, good morning to you, Angela and Nick. A good question. It really is going to depend on where your polling site is and of course, what time you showed up there. Run a step out of the way to show you what things are looking like here at the Benjamin Harrison presidential site. You can see at least now uh, probably close to 50 to 100 people are lined up. Voters, they actually started lining up about an hour and a half ago at 5 a.m. The first voter in line was a Cardinal Ritter High School teacher who told us it was inspiring to see so many Americans taking part in this election process. I'm just excited that there's a big voter turnout. I mean, this is what uh, America's all about. So we're a democracy. Uh, we select our uh, politicians, you know, by voting. And I'm glad to see everybody out coming out. It is true. It is great to see everybody out here early this morning. We can tell you almost 30% of registered voters here in Marion County have already cast their ballot. County election officials believe because of that lines will be shorter today on this election day because of the record breaking early voting here in Marion County and all across the state. But again, they are asking residents to be patient if they do face delays. New this year, only in Marion County, residents can vote at any of the county's 187 polling places, no matter where they live in the county, meaning wherever it's really convenient for them. If voting today, officials say you must be wearing a mask if you are in line and also bring your photo ID. Keep in mind that polls, they do close at 6 p.m across Indiana and election officials do want to remind residents as long as they are in line by 6 p.m. They will be able to vote. But again, they are encouraging Hoosiers to come out early today and just get it done. Angie Nick, we'll send it back to you.